to do a quick little session on stud chains. So I love stud chains, I do. I love them. I love them much more than rope halters. I put a stud chain on just to remind the horse not to be too strong in the halter. And usually I only have to put them on for very, you know, a session or so, and then they don't need them anymore. But there's a bunch of different ways to put a stud chain on a horse, and this is my favorite way. He's just a little bit pushy. Excuse me, young lady. Hey. Okay, I want to show you guys my favorite way of putting a stud chain on. I'm not going to show you all the other ways of putting stud chains on. There's a bunch of different ways, but this is the one that I like the best. So the method I like the best goes all the way around their nose. All right, uh, what we used to do, I'm not going to show you this one slowly because I'm just going to show you that this is what I used to do. Hey, little girl. We used to do it like this, but the problem is when you use it, the halter shifts. And usually, can you see? Yeah, the halter ends up in their eyes. And if you want to do this close up, Anna, that's totally fine. So that's why I stopped using this method, is because it ends up in their eye, all right? Now, some people go under the chin. The reason I don't go under the chin, see how I just strapped it under the chin? The reason I don't go under the chin is because it tends to make the horse want to lift their head higher, okay? This is Arabian style. They usually go under the chin. But then the horse tends to want to go up here, and I don't want them to go up here, right? So this is my favorite method. There's also a racetrack method that people are using now that I like a lot. Um, that they use with the racehorses, but I'm gonna show you guys my favorite way and I'm gonna actually show you how to do it. So there's, I better put a lead rope on her. There's three different lengths of stud chains. All right, go with the longest one. All right, now this is a little horse, so I probably could have gone with a smaller one, but I go with the longest one. Bring it through here. Can you see okay? Bring it through here. Wrap it once around the nose. The reason we do that is it's less severe, okay? Bring it through here and clip it back on here. Now, the reason I like this so much is now, see, it goes all the way around her whole face. So I've got control around her whole face. It doesn't shift. It's really easy to manipulate the mare with the stud chain around her nose like this and see how it gives me a lot of control. And this little girl, when she first came, she did, she was pushing me. So I did put the stud chain on for a time or two. But this method is really wonderful. Um, is it too bright? This method is really wonderful. It's definitely my favorite method. Don't forget to wrap it once around the nose band. That'll keep it from shifting down and it makes it less severe. All right. There you go.